Hello, this session we have a faculty members from the Aerospace Engineering Department to come, to come give us uh, details on its programs. So please welcome Dr. Wiss, right? Sawadee What do you teach at your department? Okay, so I teach aircraft design. So we gather the requirements and regulations from the authority and we develop the conceptual design, the sizing of the aircraft, how big is the aircraft, how many passengers it can carry. And from that, we start another design process until manufacturing to become the full aircraft. Oh, so within these four years, oh, let's talk about the undergraduate program first. Yes. The four years, the students are exposed to um, courses. Can you give me some of the name of the courses the students would have to go through? Yes, so we have three main uh, major courses. So the first one will be uh, uh, craft structures. So it's uh, a bit challenging because we try to make uh, things that strong but also light at the same time. It's, it's quite a bit conflicting but at the end eventually we manage with lightweight structures. And secondly, we study aerodynamics. So we understand the behavior of the flow of, mm -hmm. around the various shapes and bodies, yes. which is the most important things to the aircraft right. because we need lift to make it stay in the air. Yes. And lastly is the propulsion. So we study the um, engine and the cycles inside the engine for the gas turbine engine, which is the main power sources to propel the aircraft. I visited your department once. You have some kind of simulator also, yes, right? What, what is that? What is that for? Well, of course, we need to understand the control principle to control the aircraft. So yes. we, after the student understand the movement and the control surfaces, then they can try with their design or proposed uh, design oh, of I, the aircraft. I see. So, so like, actually, I think I, I, think I sat in it too, right? So like you're sitting in, in a small aircraft, yes. right? Next one I thought I want to ask is, since you are, it's an aircraft industry. Yes. Does your program uh, have a connections or collaborations with the so-called aircraft? Did you say aircraft industry? The industry, yeah. yes. Can you, can you tell me more about that? Okay, so we, we need to think of the whole industry. Um, it's a very big industry, so you have manufacturing sites mm -hmm. where you have companies that um, make parts of the airplane yes. and, and those companies are quite a lot are based in Thailand as mm. well. So we have students going internships and cooperative study in, in those companies and after they graduate they work there. So we have collaboration with, with those uh, companies. Mm. We also work with the Authority of Thailand which is Civil uh, Aviation Authority of Thailand or CAT yes. so mm. to um, develop the, the regulations, the guidelines for, oh. for, for standards of the aircraft as I well. See. To extend that, uh, nowadays drones are becoming popular, ah, so yes. we work with um, both uh, governmental sector, mm -hmm. like uh, to, to use a drone for survey for the forestry, right. um, agriculture, yes. uh, to detect the crops and um, so apply also. Yes, so, so we you apply. design, you design also, and also do the applications. Exactly. Also. Yeah. And also, I would like to know you have a a very interesting uh, international program. Of course, right? yes. Can you tell us more about that? Yes, of course. So it's called International Double Degree Program. So it's jointly run between Kasetsat University and RMIT University in Melbourne, Australia. So it has been running for over 20 years. 20 years? Yeah. I, think I heard that, I think it's one of the first international programs at the Faculty yes. of Engineering here, right? Yes. yes. So it's quite a um, <laughs> long run program and the student will spend their first three years here at Cassette Start yes. and then they continue another one and a half or two and a half years in, yes. in Australia depending on the program they choose okay. and if they con decide to continue with another year yes. they are entitled to receive a bachelor in business administration oh i see so actually if a student completed the whole five and a half years five yeah. and a half years yes they will get triple bachelor degrees degree. 
one in one Bachelor of Aerospace Engineering from Kasesa University, one Bachelor of Aerospace Engineering from RMIT, oh. and one more, one Bachelor degree from RMIT in, in Business, business Ad Administration. Lastly, do you have anything to say to our audiences about your department? Well, aerospace is a multicultural atmosphere. Yeah. It's multicultural um, work environment. Every year we receive exchange students from France, Osaka as well. Uh, so these are the, the, the way that the aerospace engineering grows right. into the future. So we need to work together in, in this, this world. So uh -huh. I encourage that if you like to come and exchange your knowledge with us, then yes. you are most welcome to, to join.